Prime Minister Narendra Modi on his day, the day two of his three-day visit to China, during which he will hold talks today with the Chinese counterpart Premier Li on issues of mutual interest, including the boundary issue and the trade imbalance. Mr. Modi arrived in Xi'an yesterday, the hometown of President Xi Jinping, and held substantive discussions with him during the day before arriving, before leaving for Beijing. He will, as I said, meet Premier Li today. Nidhi Rasa now joins us on the phone line for more. Nidhi, on day two of uh, Mr. Modi's visit to China, what is expected? And as uh, we're seeing those visuals on air, of course, uh, Prime Minister Narendra Modi on day two of his visit to China in Beijing today, uh, the second leg of his visit after substantive talks with uh, President Xi Jinping yesterday in his hometown province of uh, Xi'an. And of course, uh, uh, the foreign ministry here in India said that the talks were very, very fruitful, substantive discussions. And today, what is expected is, of course, the boundary issue, which is likely to come up, as well as the trade imbalance, which favours uh, China. Uh, Mr. Modi will meet Premier Li today at the Great Hall of People, and they are expected to discuss a whole range of issues. The talks will also uh, focus on Mr. Modi making a pitch for Make in India initiative while inviting Chinese investments in the country as well. Nidhi Rasan is back on the phone line with us. Nidhi, on day two of his visit to China, what are some of the important issues that are going to be on the table? Well, uh, we're standing here at the ceremony uh, at the Great Hall of the People where Prime Minister Modi and Premier Li Kuchang have just finished the formal welcome ceremony, which is quite spectacular. And they're walking up the stairs now uh, into uh, the building where they will have uh, talks now that are expected to last uh, about an hour or so. And uh, after which there will be a signing of agreements uh, between the two countries and uh, followed by statements to the media. Uh, this is, uh, in a sense, uh, uh, the actual formal dialogue. The groundwork was laid yesterday when Prime Minister Modi met President Xi in Xi'an, and a whole range of uh, issues were discussed. Uh, today, we are told that some 20 business agreements are expected to be signed uh, that are worth about $10 billion. Uh, there are also a, a range of other co cooperation agreements that are expected to be signed on uh, smart cities, on cities, on perhaps on outer space and other areas of cooperation. But it will be important to see what the joint statement uh, finally says uh, in terms of the political will to take uh, things forward, uh, what statement the two leaders make on the trade deficit. Uh, we will hear from Mr. Modi in a couple of hours and we will know uh, from him directly. Uh, on the issues that he raised during this visit. Uh, so the next couple of hours, uh, uh, in the next couple of hours, the formal part, in a sense, of this visit will be over. And the ceremony has just ended before the Prime Minister then will move on uh, to a university where he will take questions from students and uh, do an address. 
Right, Nidhi, and as you were saying, the next few hours will be crucial in this visit uh, on day two to Beijing. Uh, but what's also important, Nidhi, is uh, what we'll see, whether there is a substantive shift towards uh, talking about economics, because what's really uh, been dominating our relationship with China so far has, of course, been the tray, uh, the boundary issues and other issues, uh, including that with the relationship with Pakistan. That's right. In fact, the trade and uh, economy is going to be, uh, in fact, the most key part of this visit in a sense. The trade deficit was already raised by the Prime Minister uh, when he spoke to President Xi yesterday. And the two countries are really trying to see if they can work on, on the relationship by keeping contentious issues like the boundary uh, perhaps on the sidelines for now. Uh, although they are uh, talking about an early solution as well, uh, but they realize that for the relationship to for, uh, move forward, the key focus will have to be the economy. I'm afraid I'll have to... Uh, I'll have to hang up because we all have to go inside now uh, for the talks uh, you we will try and connect with you later